Last week on The Client, Nancy sent John home when he showed his true colors and revealed that he was only here for the fame and not the right reasons. Tonight, Nancy will determine which two advisors will get the coveted invitation to the executive suites. So these meetings are more important than ever. Hello, advisors. You are the final three. So this week, you're really going to have to bring your A-game. Let me explain how this is going to work. You will be each scheduled for a one-on-one -on -one meeting. At the business card ceremony, one advisor will be asked to leave the conference room immediately. Chris, it looks like you're up first. Here's the first invitation. Let's make beautiful benefits together. Nancy. I wonder what that could mean. Hi, Chris. It's good to see you again. After our meeting last week, I was starting to think maybe there's a little bit more to you, and I'd like to get to know you a little better. Nancy, I've been doing a lot of work since last week, and I've noticed that your employees aren't getting any preventative services, and that quite a few of them are using specialty medications. That's really interesting. Why do you think that is, and is there anything I can do about it? Absolutely. If you keep me around, I'll bring a proposal to the next meeting. You've given me a lot to think about, Chris. I'll look forward to seeing you later this evening at the business card ceremony. Let's be direct. Well, that doesn't make any sense. I'm always direct. Hi, Sandy. It's really good to see you again. So you said something last week that really intrigued me, but the one thing that still concerns me a little bit is how you hand me off after you make the sale. I don't understand why you're so concerned about it. Chillis has a fantastic reputation and they wouldn't have me on board if I wasn't a great salesperson. I'm honestly looking for someone who's more than just a great salesperson. I want to form a real connection and have a trusted partner with the advisor I select. If I agree to stay involved, would that make a difference? Well, maybe. But you know, my next meeting is in five minutes, so I guess I'll talk to you later. Jasmine, benefits are in the air. <laughs> benefits are always in the air for me. Jasmine, I think you know why you're still here. From the very beginning, you seemed more interested in what I had to say than what you had to say. Thank you. I just really need to know what's most important to you and your company before I make any recommendations. The company has just grown so quickly. In all honesty, the benefits have been somewhat of an afterthought. How do I figure out what we really need? Well, we do that by working our way through a discovery process to discover your pain points and opportunities for improvement. Now that sounds really cool. Unfortunately, our time is up, but I will see you soon at the business card ceremony. Nancy, advisors, it's time for the business card ceremony. If you do not receive a business card, you will be asked to leave the conference room immediately. Nancy, when you're ready. Advisors, it's been really great getting to know all of you, and you've made this a hard decision for me, but I've narrowed it down to my final two. So with that, I would like to invite Chris, and I'd like to invite Jasmine to accept my final business cards. Sandy, that means you'll need to say your goodbyes and leave. I just took a new position with Tan and Tan anyway, so I wouldn't really have time for their account. It's on to bigger and better things for me, and hopefully I'll score a few social media endorsements out of the deal. Tune in next week for the advisors tell all, and then the following week for the meetings in the executive suites and the final business card ceremony where the coveted consulting contract will be awarded.